Hi, I'm Tom Mullaney here today to talk to you about favicons in Google Sites and making favicons with Google Drawings. First, what are favicons? Well, let's look at some Google Sites I've created for digital breakouts. This is my Cuban Missile Crisis. This is my Escape the Guillotine for French Rev. Here's Warranted War Water Worry for Hydrosphere. And here's my Diwali one that teaches about ancient Indian history. Do you notice that these three each have a little icon right there in the tab? And then this, this just has the plain old Google Sites logo, so much less immersive. So let's fix that. By the way, one other thing, when you go to a new tab in Google Chrome, you see this, these are your frequently visited sites. These are all the favicons. So I know right away, oh, that's Keep, that's Jamboard, that's Maps, that's Google Calendar, right? So let's fix it. And so the way we're going to do it is we're going to go into Google Drawings first. And that is a great tool. And by the way, you notice it has a favicon. And we first of all, we set our dimensions to custom dimensions. So file, page setup, and we go to custom. Change that inches to pixels because we're talking about computers, right? And we'll set that to 512 by 512. And any rectangle with the same length and width that is a square. So we have a square now. And if you notice this checkered background, that means it's transparent, meaning you see how this missile is on its own and same with this map of France. So the background is transparent. It's not forced to take any one shape. Now I'm doing this about Diwali. It's about light and whatnot. So I'll insert, let's insert a shape and let's do a call out. And I like this star a lot. And so I'm just going to draw one real quick. And so I do that. And let's change the fill color. And actually, let's do something real cool. Let's have a gradient fill color. I like this one a lot. Ooh, I really like that. That's really nice. If I click over here, I can also get some format options, which I'm going to use just real quick to give me a drop shadow. That gives it a little bit more of a 3D-like appearance. And then if I copy and let's paste that, let's get another star and we'll do uh let's do another star and so i have oh that's kind of nice i have these three stars in the back as and if they're off center that's fine what i'll do is i'll do file download as png image okay so that's there great and now let's go into the editor in google sites go to my three dots add a favicon Upload. There it is, new favicon. Click upload. It will appear when published, so let's click the publish button. Did that. Let's hit refresh over here. And notice, there it is. You got those little stars right there. And how cool is that? It's just a little different. It's just something a little fun to give your site more personality and be more immersive. If you have any questions about this, please comment below or tweet me at Tom E. Mullaney. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.